Good afternoon and welcome to your therapist tip of the day. I'm Ms. Kat and today we are going to talk a little bit about virtual social skills. Today, more than ever, it is so important for our kiddos to be getting some interaction with their peers, even when that's just virtually. So what does this mean for our friends who have already struggled with their social skills? Well, it means as parents, we need to find some virtual groups for them to belong to, to be able to get that interaction, build upon their skills, and continue to work on things such as nonverbal communication, being able to maintain topic, and being able to initiate conversation with people. Some great examples of these are either virtual social skills groups or groups that they can participate in for movement, project-related groups, now I know what you're thinking because as a parent, I know we are all going through a lot. I'm a mom of three and I get it. We're homeschooling our kiddos, plus we're trying to work from home. So how do we fit this all in? Well, I can tell you that my children have kept up their extracurricular activities through virtual meetings, through virtual Zooms, through virtual meetups and sessions. And as much as it seemed in the beginning like it was gonna be one more thing added on my plate, I can tell you that those are the times where my kids are really truly smiling. They're engaging with their friends. And again, it's that time where I can try to sit back and there's another adult leading them through their day. So I highly, highly encourage you to find some social skills groups or some groups where they can meet up and work on one-time projects or one-time topics together to really continue to move forward with their social skills so that they're ready to join the world and their school again. This was your therapist tip of the day. I hope you found it helpful and we will see you all tomorrow. Have a great day.